for you guys kind of hung in there all night despite that tough start uh, what did you make of the fourth quarter and what did you think ended up being the difference down the stretch um, that's what it takes. I mean, we competed. We fought. Um, towards the end, it was just some missed mistakes that beat us. Didn't have to foul. So I got, well, we got to foul. That last one, the AC foul, Dane. Um, the 10 second difference. So they had to be down three. They had to shoot the ball, rebound, you know, one possession game. And then, uh, you know, the one we had to, to stop, the block on their fast break. Um, maybe cool could have got the two, you know, down one. Um, when we were down three, you got the layup and, you know, we've been down one, um, especially if we were struggling. But then again, I mean, good shooter, you know, he, he was a tough play in between. You know, a guy who shoots the, the shit off the ball, you know, didn't shoot it well tonight, wide open look. Um, you know, it's a good shot, layup, probably the right play, but, um, you know, we're leaving, living with him shooting the ball. Um, it's tough, man. It's a, it's a tough loss for us. You know, uh, position we're in, we wanted to get that one. You know, we competed, we fought. Let's say we just some, some play down the stretch and throughout the game, they kind of they hurt us. Now, AD, it was your first time playing extended minutes up to 39. You had mentioned the other night getting up to 34. Uh, was was an, it was a, a, a good thing for you as you get back to full speed? Uh, obviously, your scoring was there tonight. Um, how close are you starting to feel to being like yourself uh, with uh, with the season you know fast ending? I feel good. I feel good. Um, put me on the floor. I'm going to try to do as much as I can to help the same way. Um, I feel like I'm getting my legs back under me, uh, getting the rhythm. So uh, I think the minutes might get back, you know, extended. Uh, then also some of that too, you know, I didn't technically didn't play last night. So uh, I had a little bit more juice. Kyle. Um, AD, uh, there were some just weird plays in this game where, you know, Kyle had the the uh, offensive interference, uh, I think, with four minutes left. You had the dunk that somehow came out. I was just wondering what your reaction was to some of those plays where it looked like the ball was through and in, and it just didn't count. Yeah, it happened a couple times. I mean, I had the jump up that was down, came out. Then a three that was down that came out. But, uh, yeah, I think the uh, Kuz, uh tip back was uh, – was a legal play. I was, I was coming out. I mean, you know, the officials on the other side of the floor, so it was a tough call, tough, tough call for him. But I think, uh, you know, it was coming out on that left side, and he was, you know, made a, a great player for the tip in it. Then uh, with Donga, I thought it was a foul, a lot of contact, um, but it still was down. And then I just seen it pop back out. So I don't. It's a weird play. I mean, there's nothing you can do about it. Um, those two players didn't cost us the game, but um, it's two players that we wish that we could have had for sure. Day. Eddie, I know you told us last night that, that maybe this team could benefit from extra games. So if you play in the play and so be it. But are weird plays like that a reminder of, of what can happen if it comes down to one game? Like all the weird little things that could affect the outcome versus, you know, over the course of a seven-game series, you know, maybe those things would even out. Well, I mean, plays like that happen in a game, and it can dictate the game for sure. Um, but like I say, those plays didn't cost us the game. We had a lot of other plays throughout the course of the game that, um, you know, we broke down on, on both ends of the floor. Um, so, I mean, as you know, for sure those plays can, can cost us the game, but um, it's the other things that we can control. Um, the best mistakes that we've done and the breakdown that we had on both ends of the floor that um, can really culture the game. All right, last two questions. Dan? AD, I think two, two, kind of a two-part question. I mean, you, you guys had the eight turnovers in the first quarter and then played clean in the second and third. I think it was six, maybe more in the fourth. Um, what, what kind of change there? And then what was the on-court communication like in that last minute when it came to fouling? Um, was that something that was talked about and just mistakes were made? Kind of take me through that. 
Um, you know, we just tried to protect the ball. You know, like we had eight in the first quarter, um, and they got us that lead. And when we were able to <clears throat> take care of the ball, um, we can get shots at the rim every time and get good looks. Um, I don't know, it was, a, it was a tough play. I mean, obviously, when you're the heat, in the heat of the moment, um, you know, Ben yelling, don't foul. Um, it's just a lot going on, you know, for a player. And sometimes you don't hear the don't, you hear the foul, especially when you're down, you know, clock running. Um, you know, we just got to be smart in those situations. You know, maybe we communicated on a, um, at the timeout on a free throw line or something, we just know. Um, it's on me. I got to let the, the players know. But uh, it was a funky, funky situation. Um, you know, we can do about it now, but, you know, learn from it. You know, tell the guys when we in those situations again how to handle it. Um, and get right for the next time that, you know, that it happens if it happens. So, um, like I say, it's a tough play. We would have for sure got an, another shot at the ball with, uh, if, you know, if they missed um, the one possession game. But, that should happen in the course of the game. We'll see how learn from it. Last question, Nick Hamilton. Hey, Anthony. Uh, you guys yeah. seem like you really found, found some momentum in the second quarter. What happened? What was talked about between the first and second quarters that got you guys going and kind of got you guys in that fighting stance? We fight. Um, stop turning the ball over. But, you know, our, our, our thing was, you know, we can't allow them to outplay us. Um, I'm going to keep fighting, keep trying to basketball, keep playing together. And we were able to do that the next three quarters. Um, it's like they got some clean looks, uh, but so we, we just we got we just keep battling. It. You know, we, we battle hard and not compete tonight. Um, like I said it's a tough one, you know, to, to swallow for sure. But uh, we got to keep competing, and that's what we did all night. Just compete. Uh, like I said, it was some some plays that we wish we could have got back, but um, you know, we watch film, we learn from it, and, and figure it out. Thanks, Ad.